Hi, boys and girls and teachers. This is Dr. Schaefer here, and I'm in the TQ library, the Terry Quattrini library, to share with you three of my favorite books that I come across. This series is going to be a bunch of videos to talk about what are some of these amazing books behind me so that you can find the right book for the right student and students, you find the right book that you're excited about. All of the books that I'm about to share with you, I've read with my boys, and they absolutely love them. The first one is Dragons Love Tacos 2, the sequel. In this sequel, it is talking about what happened in the apocalyptic world of the future, where there are no longer any tacos left on this planet. What's really interesting is that to solve this problem, our young boy in the story and his dog come up with a unique solution. They create a time machine and end up going back in past to find tacos to plant in the ground because we all know that if you plant a taco, you get a taco tree. And if you have enough taco trees, the dragons will be happy. So Dragons Love Tacos 2, the sequel. Another amazing picture book that's in here is, is This Your Class Pet by Troy Cummings. I love this story, teachers, because it is a series of letters and emails and different compositions of ways that people communicate with each other. And in this, we have our dog who is writing to different people in a school because when the dog came home after visiting the school, there was a pet turtle. So Arthi is trying to find out whose pet turtle this is. And it's so cool because he writes to the gym coach, he writes to the principal, he writes to different classrooms, and they write back to him. So I'd use this as maybe an anchor text if I was teaching letters or just looking for a really cool story about class pets. And the final one that I want to share with you is Construction Site Farming Strong All Year Long. I read this with Nolan, my four-year-old. He loved it. What's really cool about this book, you may recognize sort of the details with it. Um, for this story, it goes through the different seasons. And if you have any students who love construction trucks, who love building, who love farms, it talks about what these construction trucks do in the summer, in the spring, in the winter, in the fall, and all the different seasons that occur on a farm and what the different farm equipment have to do. So those are just three of the hundreds of books that we have here in the TQ library. Like I said, this video series, I'll be hiding, highlighting a bunch of different books so that you and your students know what's here. Enjoy, and we'll see you around the TQ library.